I'd been looking and seen the, these retirement villages always seem to be down in Sussex and Surrey and the wonderful seaside places, but not near our family. As we suddenly saw this advert in the Hearts and Essex Observer for this one that was coming. It's a perfect location for us. It would get rid of the stairs, which were becoming quite a burden. I mean, a lot of our friends thought, why not have a stair lift? Why not do this, that and the other? And we said, no, we'd rather start in the fresh. The main reason Don was an only child, his parents lived up in Darlington. When they got into their 80s, we had terrible time. We had to bring them down to live with us. It didn't work, we moved them into an apartment. Then one ended up in the geriatric ward and one in a home. Um, and it was just an awful five years. I suppose we've thought about other places, but um, they didn't appeal. They, they smacked to us of care homes or old people's homes or, or whatever, rather than independent living, which is, and the, the grounds, the six and a half acres of woodland I mean, and everything here, really Sweet. appealed to us. And that was what I, we saw in the advert, that, that that was what it had, and that was why it appealed. Yeah, it's been, in its time, it's obviously been a very and beautiful it's, place. And you've got a garden without all the work. <laughs> about nine months before she mentioned about moving, and I adamantly said, no, no, I want to stay. You know, this is our house. Um, but by that time, by the time Val had seen the advert, and I was down at church one day, opened the local rag, and there it was. Local paper. Oh, local paper. <laughs> so we came, we came together, and Val said, I hope you won't be cross, but I've organised to go for an interview and have a look at one of these. The what do you day. think? And I said, Grace, uh, when is it? And she said, well, it's Thursday and Friday. We booked in for the Friday. I said, let's ring up and book for the Thursday. So we went the day previous. We got there very early, as we would. Uh, um, the young lady from Sharon, Sharon, Sharon the village uh, manager. Yeah, she she interviewed us, if that's the word. Showed us what was there. It's just having the support. I, mean, I know social yeah. services will do so much. Yeah, like but they, they can't, for you, they can't but make doors wide. No, this and is beautiful, you see, and you've got the lift up there from the car park. You've got the wide doors, all the switches that are halfway up the wall, all the thoughts of things which make life easier. And it, so it's for support for the for years to come, to know that you're not alone, really. We've shown the, the plans and the booklet to everybody that, that was interested, and they've said, oh, isn't that beautiful? Well, within a couple of days, one of our dearest friends, Ruth, had rung and said, when can we come? <laughs> so they came that afternoon with another couple of friends, Peter and Kath, and they thought it was smashing, they really did. No, no, we would recommend it to anybody. Yeah. We've only been here three weeks and we know it's definitely the right thing to have done, don't we? Yes, mm -hmm. definitely. Mm -hmm.